Well, our weather this morning actually pretty quiet. Uh, we did have some uh, rumbling around yesterday, a few thunderstorms and a uh, few showers, but also quite a bit of sunshine, not a bad Sunday. It was kind of cool. We only hit 57 degrees out at SeaTac, uh, a little bit below our normal highs, which would be in the low 60s, but never fear, we have some much warmer weather just ahead. Take a look outside this morning. Pretty quiet morning out there, mostly clear skies. I uh, can't quite tell that from our uh, Everett Tower cam quite yet, but it's clear. There, there are some areas of patchy fog around this morning, especially in the South Sound, but you see looking across Elliott Bay right now looking very glassy and just a few high clouds drifting through that increasingly early sunrise already starting to take a toll on the darkness. You can see things brightening up nicely there in the east. Checking the view down there at Bonnie High School in Olympia. You see the fog I was talking about. You see the it was just uh, oh about a half moon there disappearing down into the clouds and fog and see it there in the street lights around Olympia and down in southwestern Washington South Olympia especially in those areas you'll see the fog it's kind of scattered around elsewhere but most places like I said starting off with clear skies temperatures this morning thanks to a cool air mass and clear skies we've seen them drop down into the upper 30s and low 40s around Puget Sound some mid to upper 30s down there in southwestern Washington I wouldn't be surprised to see a few people dropping into the low 30s before the morning is over with Checking the University of Washington model, showing things looking pretty uh, clear to start off the day. Some offshore winds, and then as we head towards this afternoon, especially later this afternoon, we'll start to see some clouds headed our way. So we're going to be brushed by another passing system, very similar to what we saw through much of the end of April. That is going to bring some uh, rain in here, a little light rain overnight tonight. It'll be just a couple showers around. Tomorrow's going to be dry for most spots and a uh, partly sunny day. And then as we head on towards late tomorrow, we'll start to see the clouds increase once again. A little bit more organized system moves through as we head towards Wednesday night, keeping us in showers during the day on uh, Wednesday, though they'll gradually diminish later in the day, and then we're on track for the sun to come out and some warm temperatures. In fact, we're probably on track to see our first 80-degree reading of the day as we head into next weekend. Good timing, I'd say, overall. So for today, mostly sunny. Clouds pick up this afternoon. A light rain tonight. Temperatures in the low to mid-60s. Partly sunny. A few showers, but dry for most spots tomorrow. Mid to upper 60s. Showers and sun breaks on Wednesday. And then mostly sunny. Mid to upper 60s on Thursday. Into the mid-70s Friday. And then over the weekend right now, it looks like upper 70s and low 80s. It does start to slip a bit as we head into the following week. But uh, that is definitely something to look forward to. Our first 80s of the year. Not bad.